Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got these two overlapping quarter circles confined in the rectangle as you can see in this uh, diagram such that this uh, purple shaded area is equal to this uh, green shaded area. And moreover, we have been given the width of this rectangle as uh, 8 uh, units. And now we are going to find the value of this uh, length uh, x. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. We can see that this uh, length uh, is the radius of this uh, quarter circle. And this is 8 uh, units. So therefore, our radius for this quarter circle is going to be 8 units. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, purple shaded area. Let me go ahead and represent this area by this uh, uppercase A. And I'm going to represent this uh, green shaded area as uh, uppercase B. And now we know that the purple area is equal to the green area. So therefore, I can write A equals to B. Now let's focus on this uh, blue shaded region and we can see that these uh, both uh, blue regions are identical according to the property of uh, symmetry. So therefore if the area of this blue shaded region is C then the area of this uh, blue region on this other side is going to be C as well. And now let's go ahead and add uh, C on both sides of uh, this uh, equation. So therefore the left hand side of this equation is going to become uh, a plus uh, c equal to b plus uh, c. Now as you can see in this uh, next uh, diagram uh, this uh, a plus c is our this uh, brown shaded quarter circle area as you can see over here is equal to b plus c is our this uh, area of the yellow region as you can see over here on this uh, side. And here's our next step. Let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, brown uh, quarter circle. And now let's recall the area of a circle formula. Area equals to pi r square. So therefore the area of this uh, brown quarter circle is going to be pi times r in our case is 8. So therefore this is going to become uh, 8 square and I'm going to divide it by 4 since we are dealing with this uh, quarter circle. Let's go ahead and simplify that is going to give us uh, 64 pi divided by 4 and that is going to be equal to 16 pi. So therefore the area for this brown quarter circle turns out to be 16 pi and we know that the area of uh, this uh, brown quarter circle is equal to the area of this uh, yellow region. So therefore the area of this uh, yellow region is going to be 16 pi as well. And now let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, rectangle as well. And now let's recall the area of a rectangle formula. Area equals to length uh, times width. And in our case uh, our length uh, is x and our width is 8 for this uh, rectangle. So therefore the area for this rectangle is going to be our length is x and width is 8. So therefore it turns out to be 8x. And here's our final step. Let's go ahead and make an observation. We can see that the area of this uh, rectangle is equal to the area of this uh, brown region plus the area of this uh, yellow region and we already figured out this uh, rectangle area this uh, brown area and this uh, yellow area as well so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this equation so rectangle area is 8x equal to the brown area is uh, 16 pi plus the yellow area is 16 pi as well and now let's combine the like terms on the right hand side. So we got 8x equal to 32 pi. Let's uh, solve for x. Let's divide both sides by 8. So therefore our x value turns out to be simply 4 pi. 
So thus our x value turns out to be 4 pi units and that is approximately equal to 12.57 units. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.